as a diagnostic pathologist, the, the two tools that I use the most are a microscope and uh, a computer. And the microscope, I've been able to get my children interested in. We um, sometimes pick up dead bugs and we'll bring them home and we'll look at them under the microscope because looking at things under the microscope is fascinating. You're looking at things at 100 to 200 times um, what you would see in the natural eye. And so I think having an inquisitive mind and wanting to see more than, where, than what meets the eye um, are good qualities to have if you're interested in, in, in science. And the, the microscope I use every day and I look at tissues under the microscope and I make diagnoses. And the computer has really helped um, and assisted the pathologist in making diagnoses because um, if you had an aversion to looking under the microscope, you could now, um, there are programs that allow you to scan microscopic slides and look at them in the computer. And then there's joysticks that you can use to kind of navigate the virtual glass slide and make diagnoses um, without having to use the microscope that, that pathologists have used for hundreds of years.